Dragon Ball Super Episode 97 Survive the Tournament of Power Begins at Last. Hey guys, welcome back. And if you guys are watching this, that means you have guys have officially watched episode 97. So this video is gonna contain um spoilers and predictions for the next episode. Um God, this episode was just pretty amazing, guys. I've been waiting all day for this episode to finally um, be released. And for the past hour, I was like clicking restart on my, my webpage for the subtitles to finally come out. And I was like, restart, restart, ref or refresh, refresh, refresh. And I was like, come on, dude. And finally, I was able to watch the video, the full episode. And wow, it was amazing, guys. I did not expect that much epicness to be in a level, if that makes any sense. Uh, this notion, not the notion, this feeling that it's officially here and everyone around the whole stadium or ring just feels like they were preparing for this to happen, but when it finally happened, it's just like, they don't, not that they don't know, it's just, it's hard to explain it, um, but they found the, they felt the urgency now to survive, and I love that. And we got maybe like a minute of dialogue, and then right away everyone, boom, start start fighting, which was amazing. Um, we didn't see too much of the big names at all. Um, we saw a little bit of Goku. Well. Yeah, Vegeta we didn't see too much of, which was fine. Um, here and um, Jiren and um, the um, Kale and Kaba, we didn't see much of them. Uh, we saw a little bit of the tri the Pride Troopers, um, but that was pretty cool. So, um, but this notion that everyone came in with the plan, I liked because we weren't sure. We knew Universe 7 was coming in with the plan, but we weren't sure if other, if, if other universes were. And we, by example, we did see a couple of them. Um, I believe it was Universe 7? No, Universe no Universe 10 was the first one to get knocked off. And But the machine front, I believe, is Universe 3. His spinning, his spinning technique was pretty cool. Um... Everyone that just got in his way that they got hit was getting blown away, which is pretty amazing. But then you knew, okay, this guy's not that powerful or someone needs to get at him. And sure enough, it was Hit. Hit was the first one to stop him, so that was pretty cool. Um, I am really curious to see how Hit is going to do in this. Um... And then one thing before we start getting into like who the powerful universe is, we gotta keep in mind, guys, that everyone's kind of restricted in strength uh, because you're not fighting to the death, and so you have to so you have to hold your power back. If not a bit, maybe a one third of your one fourth of your power. So we let's keep that in mind. So we not always the strongest is gonna win. It's gonna be the one with the technique. The best technique, or unfortunately, maybe the most luckiest to to win. But well, that's going more into the episodes. We'll see how that turns out. But just something to keep in mind. Um. So yeah, we saw here, and then um, one of the universes. I believe it was Universe Six. Um, uh, it's the one with the rat dude. Um, his character. One of his soldiers. I did not um, see a suicide attempt at all. That was complete 180. And that was amazing. Um, going straight for Goku. Well, before that, Goku um, looks at Jiren like if they're going to fight. And Go I think Goku, like maybe a second after, was going to go rush to Jiren. But um, that universe, that guy from, I believe it's Universe 6. I could be wrong about that. Um, grabs him, and we're thinking, oh, come on, Goku, you could do this. Um, but it looks like he gets stronger by other opponents, um, who get stronger as they fight. Um, 
and then we saw that this whole quick little dialogue um, that Goku realizes that he's going to he's gonna take him down with him. And the guy's like, let's go to heaven together. That was an interesting line. That was pretty cool. And then everyone else started freaking out. Like, okay, is Goku done? This is a suicide attempt. Um, but in the end, Goku just barely survives. He saves SS Blue. Um, Beer is the say just use it from the beginning. But you know, Goku likes to keep everyone on their heels, which I hope it. I'm, I'm telling you guys, it might come back to bite them in the butt. But um, that little quick scene between the two, between Goku and the other fighter, was maybe my best scene or my favorite scene of this episode. That was like. I was just focused, like my uh, my jaw was dropped, like seriously, like is this guy gonna finally take down Goku? But no, he didn't. So um, that was pretty cool. And then we saw some teamwork between um, Universe Seven. Um, it's funny how everyone, the the main fighters, I would say it's it's Vegeta, Goku, um, Seventeen and Eighteen. They like and Frieza too. They quickly left after a while. We we anticipated that happening. And, but then it was the rest of the Universe 7 teaming up. And we saw teamwork, um, but we know it's going to take a little more than that. Um, so we'll see how that goes going forward. If teamwork is still going to be played a big part or eventually it's going to be like, hey guys, let's everyone just go out on their own. If you need help, give us a call. We'll see how that works. Um, but what's it called? It was pretty cool watching... Um, Everything else and um, the Xenos were amazing. I like them a lot. It's just <laughs> we finally get to see what they've been wanting to see it was an epic ro royale, and I love that. I was so happy about that. Um, and then a whole little like tablet, like knocking, letting you know whose people or which team loses their members. Um, but just quick mention, um. To go back, as soon as that first fighter fell down, I guess we were all anticipating that they were gonna get they were gonna be erased at the at the spot. I'm not sure if that was confirmed um, by the Dragon Ball team, or it was just rumors that once they fall, they were gonna be erased. But that's not the case. They get back sent to the um, the waiting um, the seating area with the rest of the gods, with their gods of destruction and their life, good gods of life, and their angels. Um, so I guess they have to wait. I guess that could kind of be, like, messed up for them. Like, okay, we're waiting, and we're waiting, and we're waiting till we die. Like, oh, like that's, like, even a worse, worse punishment than death. In a way, I'm sure it's not, but I don't know if you guys feel the same way about that. Um, so this episode, but this episode did, did seem to go by so quick, but I don't blame it. Because I guess I was just so excited. I knew like, okay, when is it going to end? When is it going to end? And I knew eventually it was going to end. And I was happy that, um, not, well, I'm happy how the way it ended. Because then we know as soon as episode 98 starts, it's going to begin with Goku fighting those six other fighters. Which I hope is pretty amazing. I think Goku's going to go Super Saiyan on them. He won't go blue until he fights someone higher. I'm, I'm, I think he's gonna go. I think Goku's gonna go Super Saiyan Blue on um, Tapo, uh, but that's yet to be seen. Um, but yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think <laughs> about this episode. Um, write down what you guys think in the comment section. What was your favorite moment from this episode? What did you want to see more that you didn't see, and vice versa? Did you see too much of one character that you didn't care about, or? Um, uh, what's it called? I, I'm curious to know if we are going to see the gods get crazy. I hope they do. I hope they. I we, I hope to see them cheer them, cheer their universe on more as we've already seen them have done. But I'm saying more and more. It's an. I have a feeling one of the gods are gonna is, are gonna die in this in this um this tournament not by their universe losing but god gets out of hand and either zeno or the great peace great priest 
um, stops them. So that's just a side note. I could be completely wrong about that, but I just have a feeling that's going to happen. Um, so yeah, episode 98 um, next week. That one's going to be even more exciting now. I can't wait for that. <laughs> Um, so let me know what you guys think again in the comments. Um, what do you guys foresee happening? And your review and th reviews and thoughts of this episode. And until then, guys, we will see you next week. Peace out.